Hello YouTube, it's Strawberry Bunnies! And today we are doing a lounge fly haul. I have um, one more Halloween bag that came in along with a Christmas lounge fly and then some like everyday lounge fly. So it's going to be kind of a big haul. So let's go! Please like, share, and subscribe. And if you're new here, hello! If you're a returning subscriber, one of my blueberries, hiya! So remember, you can always subscribe to me. It is free, and I do pick your name for a giveaway once a month to give your gift card if you're subscribed to me <laughs> and comment down below. All right, let's go. So the first thing is this Loungefly wallet with Zachary Binks from Hocus Pocus. It is furry, like he's a stuffed animal. The back doesn't have fur. It has the Sanderson sisters. Sarah, Mary, and Winifred. There's the Salem house with the like purple smoke that they get when they're trying to make the potion to get the little kids and some swamps. This is the wallet I'm using right now, so I'm going to show you the inside. But the inside just has purple stars and swirlies and binks. So, I have the purse that goes to this. The purse didn't come in when I did my Halloween bags, but that's okay. It's here now. Let's open it. I haven't even seen it. I know someone's gonna ask, why are you out of breath? I still have that, in, that respiratory infection. That's pneumonia. But I am doing a lot better. But you can still hear. I sound really breathy, like Marilyn Monroe, like, ha. Ah, how are you? <laughs> Bam! Like, that speaks for itself. Look at how nice. The Sanderson sisters with the moon. Binks down here with the black flame candle. Binks on the bag as well is he's furry. Ooh, he can even move his fur. Gold eyes. There's the Salem house, just like on the wallet, except in this one they are flying. You see that okay and then the back it's just a bunch of hocus pocus with the cauldron super cute what is that it was just like a little fuzzy <laughs> and this was um you could get this anywhere like I think you could still buy this on Amazon and box lunch the side says lounge fly in black and gold. Ooh, that's fancy. And then the other side is just plain. They do have pockets. And let's see what's in the inside. Probably like my wallet. It doesn't have a zip or a pocket in there, but the pattern is the same as the wallet with that pretty um, binks and like stars and cauldron and it's purple and blue. It's really cute. I love the contrast that they did here where it's all black and gold. I thought that looks like kind of really fancy and I love the black flame candle. The black flame candle is actually like a soft leather so it's nice to feel that with the fur of Binks. But yeah, but so that was that whole collection. So now let's move on to the other Halloween bag I got which is from the Disney Parks and can you guess what it is? Huh? Huh? Matches these ears. It is like ghosts this year. I think that ghost in the middle, he's like a heavy plastic, he might glow in the dark. Um, so we've got ghosts, uh, like bruise, a witch spell, candy corn, hard candy, and jack-o'-lanterns. And then the bow itself is little um, orange sequins. So now let's look at the bag. I don't know if I showed it, but it does say boo on the side. I just open them and can you see what I see? His ears are all messed up. I'll have to see if they'll send me another one because I don't like that. Especially how it's bent. I don't know if I can unbend that. It even has this that's supposed to help them stand up but it's, it's not going to do a lot because they're already bent. Anyway, we'll just move on. <laughs> so here's the pattern. It's super cute. It goes with the ears. But I was looking and I've got a Pluto, some Chippendale, Donald and a candy corn outfit, Daisy's head, 
but Mickey and Minnie aren't on my bag. They look like this though. Mickey is over here in a jack-o'-lantern outfit and Minnie is this uh, cat, this purple cat. The pattern's adorable. Oh, and there's Goofy as a tree. Super cute, love the pattern. Mine, that's kind of interesting that it doesn't have the rest of, on of, of them on it, but that's okay. I really am not liking those ears. I'll have to see if Disney will send me another and I can return this. The inside, so cute. Has ghosts and the pumpkins and candy corn cupcakes. So, so cute. Let's see if it has a pocket. No pocket. I don't like when Disney Park does that because these are not cheap. This is a hundred dollar bag. Where's the pocket? <laughs> but here it is. It says Disney Parks Lounge Fly. I love that it's like vintage and looks like the 90s. That I thought was super cute. And I don't really have a bag like this. Like all of you know, a lot of my lounge flies are food. <laughs> So I liked the food on here, but I liked them all in their costumes. I thought it was cute. Here's more of that pattern. It's so different. I just love that. Super cute. The next is another Disney Parks bag, and it is their Christmas. I know, Christmas already. I hate that. I hate Christmas before Halloween. <laughs> but oh well, let's get, let's get into it. I had to get it before it sells out. Ooh, nail cam. Candy corn nails. So a lot of you probably already know, what do you think is on it? Dizzy Parks food. <laughs> so this has gingerbread and Mickey ice cream bars and peppermints and uh, candy canes. Like what? <laughs> oh, does it not have to? Yes, it has gingerbread. I was like, what? They're just not on this side. So on the front is a giant peppermint that is shiny. That's going to go great with a lot of my Christmas ears. Um, I might wear these even with my gingerbread ones. Like super cute. This is a pocket as well. I'm going to have to bend this one down, but he's okay. It's also leather mixed with the red. That is just so shiny. It's so fancy. This is going to sell out. There's the Disney Parks logo in white. I love that it's this pretty blue because this is gonna be way easier to not get dirty, unlike the bag they had last year, which was pure white, and it was Mickey and Minnie skiing. I have that, I bought my niece one, but this is gonna be way easier to keep clean. The handle is different. We've got little like clasp like that. Is it different? Yes, because the other has ears. The back, candy cane striped straps. Here's the back with candy canes, gingerbread men, and more of the ice cream, super cute, and also little snowflakes. Super, super cute. Super, super cute. Let's open it. No pocket again. Don't like that. Don't like that, Disney. Peppermint, red, and little like stars. Almost forgot the cutest thing ever. The little charm, which is a gold Mickey Mouse with a bow tie. Cute. So a lot of you know I have this whole entire collection, which is the Dizzy Parks uh, Snacks. This is the newest one that came out. It is a, like, eggnog, ye off yellow white. It is a Mickey ice cream cone that has a bite out of it. <laughs> this is a pocket. Chocolate is dripping down. Oh, it says Disney Parks. And this pretty tan peach color. And then the Mickey ice cream bar all the way around it. Now this collection, all of the bags, smell like the dessert. The popcorn smells like popcorn. It smells like caramel popcorn. The Mickey waffle cone. It did smell like waffle cone and like maple syrup. Loved it. The pretzel doesn't smell anything like a pretzel. It kind of smells like Play-Doh. So the moment of truth. 
Will it smell like ice cream? Will it smell like the Mickey chocolate ice cream bar? No. Just smells like a coach store. <laughs> like just leather. That's all it smells like. I'm not smelling anything ice cream. Okay, ice cream bar. No pocket, sadly again. <laughs> Ears, I have the waffle, which has a glob of butter, and I also have the pretzel. Out of all the bags, the waffle is my favorite. I love the glob of butter, all of that. It's gorgeous, but I know I'm going to get it dirty because it's white. So for me personally, I'll be using the Mickey pretzel bag with my ears the rest of the time in the park because it won't get dirty. I think that the Mickey ice cream would also get dirty because it's still just a white that's a yellow white. I didn't get the ears for it either. That was okay. This is the next one. This is from LA Style Rush. This is a limited edition from them and it is a giant, giant taco. <laughs> Look at the size difference here. And it's still a mini backpack, so let's open it. I, I can't. I, I can't. This came out around my birthday in April. And I kept looking at it and looking at it and looking at it. And I didn't know it was this big. And I was like, uh, I, I, I want it. I want that Taco Tuesday. <laughs> so we've got this taco. And it feels like, like it's textured like a taco shell. We have lettuce, cheese, um, onions something else in there and then the bag itself on this side is green and red like it's supposed to be guacamole and hot sauce brown for your hamburger meat oh yeah and then the zipper just kills me it kills me so they have this soft like leather one but then we've got a hot sauce here's the hot sauce and it has like a hot pepper on it and a mickey head and it says a uh, hot chili. <laughs> so let's open it up. I haven't opened it up. Oh, and here's the back. So look at this. I'm wearing this to every Mexican restaurant I can find. <laughs> it's a sewn on Mickey Lime. How cute is that? Okay. 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 We got to open it. It also came with straps to make it a crossbody. I don't know how I'm going to show this. So I'm going to have to put a sticker like an image here that shows the inside, but it has hot sauce, avocados, Mickey ears, and little pieces of salt. So, so cute. I've had this up on my um, uh, launch fly shelf over there, just setting in the plastic. So many people have picked this up like, what? So fun. This guy was from Hot Topic. I had a good deal on him. <laughs> And one thing I didn't need more of was Winnie the Pooh purses. I have three, but it's cute because it has the heffalumps on it and they're all different colors. And um, he's eating Pooh's honey. I like how cute that is. Like this whole bag is adorable. The plaque, of course, is leather right here. Doesn't have side pockets. The back is just white, nothing back there. Some Hot Topics, these straps are the honey gold, and the inside should just be one solid color because that's what Hot Topics does with lounge fly, usually unless it's something like really, really special. Yep, just, just this pretty orange. Let's see if it has a pocket. And look at that. Hot Topics gives you a pocket. <laughs> And this was $49, which I did get on sale with, you know, Hot Topics cash and all that. The next is a Hot Topics bag as well. This, so this is the same Rio bag from Hot Topic. A lot of you know it because they make Hello Kitty. But on this, we've got My Melody, her sheep friend, which is something like Melody, but different. And then um, the evil girl, Yumi, Creamy, something. I'll put the names. But then we have all these like pictures on the wall. They're having a sleepover, a slumber party. And they've got cupcakes. It's really cute. The back, the sides are just purple. The back's 
um, purple as well. And the inside's probably going to be purple, one solid color. Yep. Purple. And it does have a zipper with a pocket. So a pocket with a zipper. The Lisa Frank Paint and Panda back. It's so cute. This is popped out like their stickers that are um, like smooth. Panda's blushing and smiling. His hat's like that too, like a sticker. He's got a little pink brush. That's rainbow. So it is gorgeous. This bottom half looks like it's blue jean material, but it's not. It's still leather. The plaque is pink with rainbow around it. A lot of you know Lisa Flint. <sighs> Lisa Frank is known as the artist that everything she draws has rainbow colors, it's vibrant, it's beautiful. She was more popular in the 90s when I was a kid, and yeah, just, I, I love this. He was one of the most popular stickers that she sold. They put his face on erasers, pencils, book bags, all kinds of stuff, even plush book bag. Adorable. This side is just the blue jean. There's the Lisa Frank logo. This was from Box Lunch or Loungefly website. The pocket on the panda is actually a pocket. The inside ah, is the painting panda with the rainbows and the paint splatter. That was actually a sticker you could get back in the day. And there is a pocket in the back. Not a zip one, but it's still a pocket. It's super cute. I absolutely love this. I'm surprised how cute it is. It's like even cuter than I thought. They do have wallets, but yeah, I didn't get one. <laughs> Maybe later on, but a lot of the Lisa Frank collection sold out quickly. Um, she did uh, makeup palettes a couple years ago, and I have some of those, which are super cute. But love this. Love it. I'm going to use it. I, I don't care. <laughs> So this is from Box Lunch. This is my second Max and Roxanne bag. This is the scene where Max is daydreaming about Roxanne. They're in a field and she leaps off into his arms and they giggle and they fall in the hay. And it's super cute. She's like a goddess in this. This is her, ear, her uh, necklace, the plaques on the front here. Oh, I just love that. This is pretty like um, deep pink, red color. They have pockets, no front pocket. The back has Roxanne uh, flying. Whee! <laughs> and then it does have a handle. And the zippers are rose gold, which I'm pretty sure this is the only bag that I have where the zippers are, are ro rose gold. So let's see what the inside looks like. It is Roxanne trying to shake Max's hand and he just closes his eyes and kisses her. <laughs> Has a zipper pocket and I did get the wallet. It was clearance. It was really cheap. It was like $5, but it's that scene, just bigger. And Roxanne's blushing. It's this pretty like aqua color with little flowers. There's the plaque. And then the inside has them in hearts doing the same kissing scene. And it also has a flap part. Isn't that cute? So yeah, I can't wait to use this. I don't know why they did these two different colors, but that's all right. Maybe this was a bag you could get as well, but I'm, I'm happy. And this is the last bag. This is a Merida, and this is a Danielle Nicole bag. It's got Merida's Target that's bumpy textured. Her tabard color of her family, that pocket in the front, these zippers say Pixar. Um, and then it has this pretty like woven Scottish symbol on the side. The back is just like a like deep grape color and it says Danielle Nicole and Pixar's up there. This was also from, you get this also at Box Lunch or um, pink a la mode. I think it was on sale at pink a la mode like pretty cheap I think this was like a $20 bag which never happens So the Daniel Nichols have pockets for your cell phones and stuff in the front And then it has a bigger 
pocket in the back with a zipper and says Pixar right there and Daniel Nicole. The inside's a pretty like green with little, it's like a greenish gray and has DK for Daniel Nicole. Super cute. Happy with that, especially for 20 bucks. That, that's adorable. And I don't have anything that's Merida. So I think that's all the bags. There's a pretty like leaf pattern. And of course she has her bowl. She can't go anywhere without her bowl. But yeah, so I really love that. But that was all 10 of the bags. So please like, share, and subscribe. Tell me which one was your favorite. Tell me if you see something else that you want to get, but you're unsure of it because I could get it. We could do a review on it. But anyway, please like, share, and subscribe. And I hope you come back to my channel. And I hope you have a happy Halloween. Bye!